Hello, Internet, and funny format, huh? Today, I'll be telling two funny, awkward, frustrating, whatever you'd want to call them, little anecdotes. One of them being the living proof of my terrible bad luck and how I've been a victim of it since God knows how long. But anyways, it all started when I was heading back home from a trip to, I don't know, I forgot. I've been pretty tired from the two-hour flight, and I just wanted to get home and finally rest. We've just been informed of a little delay that there was gonna be. I was alright with it, cause I thought to myself, well, I haven't eaten properly, but it's okay, I could wait a few more minutes. Five hours I have waited for the flight. I've already experienced many flight delays in my life, but god, this one was horrendous. I'd felt all kinds of distress. I was hungry, thirsty, and the worst of all, sleep deprived. And after all of that, we finally boarded a plane. I knew it was gonna be a long flight, but at the same time I was sure it was the last step to get back home. The flight has been delayed due to an engine problem. Please take off the plane immediately. Oh, for the love of god! Well, that's been a hell of a trip. Now, getting to the other topic, a lot of people have heard of the term Uncanny Valley. What not many people have experienced though is the Uncanny Valley up close. I was having a sleepover in one of my friend's houses. And in one of the rooms, she had one of those over-realistic looking baby dolls. And I've watched too many horror movies to know that that wasn't gonna end well. But then, in the darkness, I've sworn to everybody that I could see that it had moved. It looked at me with those baby doll eyes. And after I've turned my sight away, I saw it stirring its head around and pull it on. And ever since then, I haven't been the same. But did all of that really happen or did you just made up that last part? Oh, well, I don't know. 